Okay, today we're going to show you a little video of uh, the Zoltrax M200. Just a little unboxing video to show you what you get in the uh, in the box. Always nice being able to see inside and see exactly what you're getting. Now there's uh, our business card and a uh, UK plug there, and a little startup guide, a setup guide, which shows you everything you need to go to get printing. As you can see, it's packaged pretty well. Um, so you've got this top bit of foam that just holds everything in place while it's in transit. We'll just take that out and then see what's inside. So here's the printer. Um, it's just in a bag, just to keep the dust out. Probably best to leave the bag on, actually. Put it back down. So just put that down, lift it out. Quite a heavy printer, but um, just it reinforces the fact that it's been made really well. Um, it's all it's all a met solid metal frame, it just keeps it particularly sturdy. Now it's quite good. They've utilised the space inside the printer to uh, package up some of the accessories. Let's just just remove this section here. It's another. Next bit of foam. And then underneath is the starter pack. But so, inside this bit of foam, we just remove this disc. So there's a Zoltrak Z ABS spool in there, and that's the filament guide. It's a pure white that comes comes with the printer. It's nice and snug in there to get that out. There we go. And you've also got uh, that's the spool holder, just to go on the back, and a test print, which was printed on your printer. They do this in the factory just to check if it's working okay, which is good to know. Now let's get the starter kit out. It's quite a sub substantial kit, this one, actually. Um, Especially compared to some of the other printers available. Uh, as you can see, that's the there's the heated bed. That's the bottom of it there. Bottom side up, and then on the other side is the perforated side. Now look how generous they've been with all these accessories. Um, you do not get as many things with other printers, um, so it's really handy that they put all that in. There's your SD card that just slots in the front there. That's a great way to keep files um, and print uh, away from your computer. So let's have a look inside the starter kit. As we mentioned before, there's the heated build plate. Take and then also we've got Oh, they are the clips that hold the uh, wire strips um, in place on the back of the machine. Um, that's also a filament guide. And here you've got the uh, nice scraper. A really good one actually with the NT100. Much better than uh, a lot of the other ones we've tried using, uh, getting prints off the bill plate. There's some Allen key set and those two little tubes inside there is a little needle that's just about the right size to go up the nozzle um, which can be quite handy if it ever does become blocked. It's also an SD card uh, reader that goes into a USB slot which is quite handy if you don't have one on your machine. A few other tools to help clean up your prints uh, like a scalpel, you've got some tweezers, uh, another craft knife and there is also there uh, a little um, tool to get the, the nozzle off if you ever need to, along with some gloves and some goggles, just to keep you safe. Thanks for watching. If you like the video, then please click to subscribe. For more information on the printers and materials we've used in this video, visit dream3d.co.uk